just run it all. I'ma tell you how it is. And you know where I am. You know I'm so might run up in your crib, but I'm gonna die. What is up my Deagle Seagull eyes here, how are you guys doing today? In this video I'm going to be starting a new series where we will be looking at the top 10 glitches within GTA 5 Online. So this is a really beneficial series that I will be starting up for you guys as you are able to check out all the best glitches combined in one video and the video will be shortened down so it won't be longer than 10 minutes hopefully but if it has to be longer than 10 minutes then it will be but I guarantee you guys that it will be less time consuming for finding glitches as you are able to get all the top 10 working best glitches within GTA 5 online with the series I'm about to start for you guys. The first glitch we're going to be looking at is the instant death glitch. So this was previously a god mode glitch where you would be able to pretty much go inside this wall bridge sort of glitch and it would be right under the uh, bridge itself and it's near Los Santos Customs. So once you arrived at this location, all you need to do is go all the way to the corner of the bridge where you will find this bit over here and you just want to jump over and you will pretty much instantly die. But previously you could be able to actually go inside here until Rockstar Games decided to go ahead and patch this glitch and pretty Pretty much make it so it's like a troll basically in other words whenever players would go into this wall breach that they would just instantly die so I'd call this the instant death glitch now so it's a really good way to troll your friends as well so I'd really highly recommend checking out this first glitch for GTA 5 online once you climb up you won't be able to escape as it will instantly kill you in my opinion I think it's a really nice glitch as you're able to troll your friends but yeah other than that it's a pretty useless glitch in my opinion but yeah that's all I have to show you guys for this first glitch so, so let's go to the second glitch go ahead and get ready over your character over to Suburbans which is a clothes store and go over to browse the clothing and you guys can choose any vest it doesn't really matter but for me the one that worked for me would be the olive check vest as it worked for me so just go ahead and apply any of the vests and uh, you want to go ahead and go over to the vest shirts then and apply any one of those as well so the one that worked for me for the vest shirts would be the black band vest shirt so just go ahead and put on any of them and it should work either way but I just think personally that the the black one looks a lot better so go over to your interaction menu style and go ahead and go to accessories and make sure that you can see watches and just switch the watches to the white led black strap watch you just want to go over to right like once or maybe twice or something like that until it works and uh, just go ahead and do that now back out of that and go over to gloves now once you switch the gloves you should notice that you have invisible arms within a gta 5 online so this is the invisible arms glitch working on patch 1.35 so i hope you guys did enjoy and let's we we'll go on to the next glitch now. The next glitch we're going to be looking at is the mule truck launch glitch. So in case you guys didn't know, you can go ahead and purchase this online on the website in GTA 5 Online. And it is called from Pegasus. You can't store this mule truck because it is not like a storable vehicle. But once you have called in from Pegasus, you just want to go ahead and uh, go over to this location where I am at right now. As long as it has like a sort of a ramp that you can just go off it and it should work properly. But you just want to go ahead and climb on top of the mule truck. And uh, once you've done that, just go ahead and go over to... To the side over here where you will be able to just go ahead go back and forth and you just want to keep doing this and when your friend drives that mule truck he will just go ahead and make you launch up in the air I'll be showing you guys the flaming car glitch now sort of trick as well if you guys want to call it like that but I wouldn't really classify this as a glitch maybe it might be a glitch I really don't understand the logic where the car wouldn't blow up anyway you could say this is a glitch as well but yeah let's go ahead and see how you guys can do the flaming car glitch within a GTA 5 online to start off this glitch just go ahead and grab any random vehicle it doesn't really matter it can be a personal vehicle as well and uh, all you have to do is just go ahead and go over to your inventory and when you go over to your inventory you want to go over to the section where you can find your firework launcher go ahead and launch it up by the windows in front of the car and you will notice now that the fire is spreading around the car so just quickly go inside the car and just drive around and you should now notice that the car is not actually blowing up and yeah so this is the flaming car glitch so you guys should just go ahead and check out this glitch 
One of my favorite glitches would be the save any CEO outfits as you are able to just go ahead and pretty much store these rare outfits within your wardrobe itself as you can't really obtain them until you're like a you know bodyguard so just go ahead and do this glitch and you can just go ahead and store any of these rare outfits. In order for this glitch to work you will need to have like a bathroom or something where the shower is and uh, you can have one of these like showers in your apartment and in your yacht as well so once you have arrived at those locations you just want to go ahead and go over to your friend and you will need a friend for this glitch itself and just, just go ahead and tell your friend to invite you to the VIP and once you've been invited just go ahead and quickly accept it from the phone and once you're in just go ahead and tell your friend to just hover over the outfits that you would like to you know save and it's a pretty simple glitch in my opinion so all you need to do is just go over to the shower and the moment you press the use a shower button and you just want to tell your friend to dismiss you from the CEO and once you're dismissed you just want to press cancel on the showering bit and once you've done that you should now notice that you have the CEO outfits as the bodyguard but unfortunately this doesn't work for the host of the VIP which is the CEO himself so you can just go ahead and access the wardrobe and save the outfit and in case you guys didn't know I didn't really know this as well but there's actually a wardrobe in the yacht itself which is quite hidden on the back side but if you go over there and then press the button to use it you can access your wardrobe and just go ahead and save the outfit Okay, I'm going to be showing you guys how to save any rare outfits now. So just go ahead and go over to start and go over to online jobs, Rockstar created versus and then host up truck off. And once you go ahead and host up truck off, you will be loaded up into the skies and then it should say you're loaded in the bottom right hand corner as you can see right now and you will be loaded into the versus mission itself. So once you go ahead and launch in the versus mission, you just want to go ahead and invite one friend as it says you will need at least two people in the lobby itself in order for it to launch up successfully. So once you've done that, just go ahead and invite one of your friends. And once you have convinced your friend to join you, just go ahead and launch it up. When you load in, you can just go ahead and select any of the outfits you would like to save. So this could be like any of the rare outfits that you are seeing on this section over here that you would normally not be able to obtain within free mode itself. So you can just take this with you to free mode and then access your wardrobe and just save it. So I really highly recommend getting a rare outfit as you're able to store it in your wardrobe. For me, I'm just going to choose any random outfit and I'm going to ready up now. So all you need to do now is just drive this truck into the water itself and you will fail the mission and uh, that is a good sign now because now you know that the glitch is working so now we'll move on to the next step. After you see the ending results where it says kills, deaths, RP and cash, you just want to go ahead and press continue and tell your friend to uh, press continue as well. When you have clicked continue, you just want to ask your friend to click the replay button once and uh, when you see the time on the bottom right hand corner, you just want to let it go to about 10 seconds and as soon as it gets to 10 seconds you just want to go over to your recent activities and join any of the recent activities that you played and it should say start mini game so that's how you'll know how it works you need that like little feature on your recent activity so once you click start mini game it will kind of glitch you in like this where you will be kind of glitched out like here as you can see on the screen and when you load in it will say are you sure you want to quit the session you want to cancel and you will be spawned inside your garage now so you're just going to go ahead and go over to the elevator and head upstairs and you will be just go ahead and pretty much just go over to your wardrobe and save the outfit. For any reason, if you are unable to save your outfits, you can do this next glitch. will pretty much like glitch out your inventory and then when you go ahead and find a new session, you will still have the outfit. So this is like a sticky method in order for this glitch to, you know, actually work. You can always go over to your interaction menu and go over to the section of where it says inventory and go over to body armor and make sure that one body armor is visible and you click auto show armor for at least five seconds until it lands on on and then just you know disable the body armor make sure it's invisible and then just go ahead and go over to accessories and click on parachute for at least five seconds until it says on and off for 10 seconds and just wait for it to land on on and then press circle to back out and go over to auto show bike helmet and auto show aircraft helmet and you want to spam five seconds on them as well till it lands on on so just go ahead and spam on and off for at least five seconds until it lands on on so once you've done that just go ahead and go over to start online find new session and now you should now notice that when you load into a new session you will be able to see now that you have got the outfit that you wanted from the job itself. 
For the next glitch, I think you guys will really like this glitch as you are able to go under the map within creator mode and then you can pretty much just like create modded races, modded death matches and all that sort of stuff that you would not normally be able to create within GTA 5 Online. So you can access this glitch where I will be showing you in this video now. Let's go ahead and see how you guys can just go under the map within creator mode. To start off this glitch, you want to press start and go over to online and click creator mode and just load up into creator mode. When you have loaded creator mode, you can choose any of the settings whether you want to create a deathmatch, race, capture, last team standing but for this video I'm going to be creating the race for creator so once you've done that just click on it and it will bring you to a screen like this where you will be able to apply the placements and objects and all that sort of stuff you just want to go all the way to the uh, sandy shores area and you just want to go all the way to this section on the map to confirm you are at the right location you should notice there are loads of windmills around you and you want to go over to this exact windmill you should see this bit right here and you just want to go all the way down until you can pretty much just go under the map and once you've done that you should now notice that you are under the map within a GTA 5 online in the creator mode and when you are in the camera selection screen you just want to keep descending until you can go under the map and once you've gone ahead and gone under the map you just want to make sure that your screen flashes black at least once go over to race details and then click on photo and you should now be able to see now that you are under the map and you can pretty much see everything that is above you and uh, that is now how you guys can just go ahead and place objects under the map now once you are ready to create your desired deathmatch, race, last team standing and much more. I also know that the Trash Master outfit glitch was also patched as well but there is a new method for this now so there is like a workaround for this glitch so you guys can obtain the Trash Master outfit once again within a GTA 5 online so in case you guys didn't know this is classified as one of the rare outfits as well that you can obtain so I'd really highly recommend doing this glitch. It is pretty much the same concepts for the other glitches where you would be able to get the outfit so you just want to go over to online jobs and go over to Rockstar Creator jobs and click versus and then head over to truck off so once you've gone ahead and loaded truck off you just want to invite one friend in order for this glitch to work properly so then you can guys you can just go ahead and launch up truck off once you have loaded the session you will be brought up to a screen like this where you will be to select your outfit so you just want to select over to the section where it says dead funny and now you will be to see that one of the teams has a trash master outfit so this is the team I'm on right now you just want to click ready to play you will see a black van nearby to so just go ahead and drop this off into the ocean and it will fail the mission Next you will be able to go on the voting on the next job screen so just ask your friends to click replay once and then go over to your recent activities and join any of the mini game. You want to click start mini game as soon as it gets to 0 seconds and now your game should be glitched out like this where you will be able to go inside your garage and then head over to the, your apartments and save the outfits. And that's how you guys can just go ahead and do the trash master outfit glitch within GTA 5 online working on update 1.35 after all the other patches. Well let's go ahead and look at this launch glitch now that I discovered in GTA 5 Online. So if you go over to Del Perro Pier Beach and you go all the way to the end of the pier you will find this umbrella over here. So you just want to climb up over onto the umbrella and uh, you just want to ask your friend to go ahead and throw an explosive where you are. And uh, you have to make sure that you are in passive mode and once the explosive blows up your character will automatically launch up within the sky itself. Unfortunately this is not a solo launch glitch as you will need a friend to help you out with this glitch and you need to go in passive mode so then it works properly. It's a pretty easy glitch to do and it's not really that time consuming so I highly recommend that you guys go ahead and check this one as well. Finally, for the last glitch within GTA 5 Online in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can save any random gloves onto a biker suit. So just go ahead and apply any of your favorite biker suits from the new DLC and just go ahead and head over to your yacht. If you don't have a yacht, you can also ask your friends to help you out. There is a guarantee that at least one person on your friends list will also have a yacht. So I'm pretty sure that at least one of your friends will have a yacht. If not, you can also comment down in the comment section below if you want to ask other people to help you out. But for me, I have already got a yacht and I have pretty much billions of dollars within GTA 5 Online so it is not necessarily important for me to go ahead and invite my friend in order for him to help me do this glitch so it is pretty much solo, I can just, just go ahead and do this on my own. Get any random transport and head over to the yacht itself. Upon your arrival at the yacht, you should find the jacuzzi by the yacht itself. So just go over to your interaction menu, then select style and you want to go all the way to the select 
section where you can find this feature where it says the change gloves option so that will be available on the accessories as well if you go all the way down to the bottom you should now see where it says white surgical gloves so if you just go ahead and put that on as soon as you get in the jacuzzi then you just want to quickly go ahead and climb up onto this platform and once you've gone ahead and climbed up onto this platform you should now notice that you have got the gloves saved onto that preset outfit that you cannot change so it is a recommended glitch to check out in order for the glitch to work properly in order for you to go ahead and put on any gloves on a preset outfit so when you do go ahead and put on a like gloves normally on a preset outfit it will just go ahead and actually disable the outfit so so this is a glitch that you guys can just go ahead and check out that's pretty much it for the top 10 glitches within gta 5 online i hope you guys did enjoy this video if you guys could go out of your way to leave a like rating on the video that'd be really appreciated as it does show your support towards my videos and my upcoming videos and if you are new around here then why not subscribe for more gta 5 content that you guys can just go ahead and check out my channel also feel free to leave a comment down in the comment section below on any of the glitches and if you guys are having any problems at all i will go ahead and try and respond to as many comments down in the comment section below so as always stay awesome my deagles and i will catch you guys on the next video peace He the final wife, find a good guy. He the final lady, find a good guy. I'm sorry, searching for a good guy. I'm sorry, searching for a good guy. He the final wife, find a good guy. He the final lady, find a good guy. I'm sorry, searching for a good guy. I'm sorry, searching for the real guy.